All right, so it's been a little while since you guys heard from me. Two months, two and a half months, most. And this critical guy realization man here, aka critical guy realization, undivided attention guy here, 09. Um, yeah. Follow me on my main channel if any people know who I am, but this is going to be a two part video because this is going to be a long, lengthy video, man. I'm talking about old school conspiracy theories ish. And uh, the stuff I heard. I heard this February 27 when it happened. So, uh, financetimes.com. And this one happened three days ago. By the time you guys see it, it'll probably be a week old or less. This one happened a little while ago, like two months, two weeks ago. So, these two are more recent. This one's a month old. And uh, this is usually from my backup channel, my main channel, the Nintendo Sony for 2011, as you guys knew me before. I'm random pop culture news guy. So there is that. So I gotta keep it down a little bit because it remains sleeping and it's almost 3.45 in the morning. It's very, very late. So yeah, um, without further ado, let's begin. This one, if you guys want to subscribe to my main channel, like, share, subscribe, comment. Probably good to hear my voice again. And I'm just assuming, hopefully, you do. Just subscribe, share, and share the content which you can. Usually I put this more on bit shoot and lines. <laughs> That's how I do it now. I know he died a while ago, so links all through for you, maybe 40 articles down below. Member of the European Banking Union Di Man Dynasty, huh? and various institutions were prominently patrons of the arts, and we know this as he'd been in the truth seeker alternative media, like, resistance, sort of like, tinfoil hack community, no. Absolutely decrepingly, absolutely decimating. Now, Mr. Rothschild and Rockefeller were... <laughs> Extremely ultra disgusting evil ass motherfuckers and they're unfortunately burning a real real bad place in purgatory hell somewhere. Which I'm not gonna say it too badly because I don't want YouTube to shut down this channel, but we'll see. Philosopher philanthropist Lord Jacob Rothschild dies, as he says. I'm still gonna give credit to the fool that made this, I'm not sure who it was. Shutter Cam Ben Schwartz, oh, Stephen and Morrison and Frank Nelson from Financial Times. Yeah, Jacob Ross has died at 87. Good, good fucking riddance. <laughs> this dude was just like that other dude, fucking Kissinger and Klaus Schwab. I mean, Schwab's still alive. But <laughs> and Gil Bates, people want to take over the worlds and take over people's brains and all that shit, like microchips, like Elon Musk. Fuck that dude, by the way, I don't care about him. <laughs> I've stopped giving a shit about him last year. That's why my main channel, I'm not talking about Elon Musk news anymore. I did say I was going to start doing it, but screw it. I'm playing some relaxing music in the background from um, Pizza Time Hotline. And Dreamcast music. So if you guys want to leave the link to the description box below for the music, there it is. Statement of the News PA. <coughs> Excuse me. Rothschild Ham says, quote, our father Jacob. <sighs> it was just like Rupert Murdoch and all these fools. They want power, control, and authority over humanity. Just control humanity and just destroy them burn every single freaking little bit of the land that they own. Take over everything. Do it all. Evil, evil, in my personal opinion. Not even just satanic little man or world order shit. Not even just the Masons and all that. They're just pure, downright, pure fucking evil. So sorry, Extremely you. super mega oh, evil motherfuckers. Extremely ultra evil. Like, I want to talk about super villains like Bobby Kodak and these other fools like Mr. Charles Mason. No, that dude died a while ago. Etc. Cetera, Etc. Cetera. I know those the mainstream ones like they did two, three years ago when they made that video, that movie on Netflix about um, Jeffrey Dahmer, and then the other one about Ted Bundy. I know those are super evil ass mother ever too. They're on that level. You know, it's oh they never hurt or killed or murdered or took anyone's life anywhere. They did, in my opinion, they did. The straight up Epstein levels of that shit's insane. That's from uh, and for Ross Ross, I said Father Jacob. I meant to split this into two videos because. 15 minutes ain't enough for me to talk about this shit. I gotta go fucking longer. Towering president of many people's lives, he would be buried in the corners of... Can't say that word. Custom small family ceremony, no, because of the death was given. Born April 36, 1936. Mr. Rothschild was a, educated at Etting, Eton College before studying history at Christchurch, Oxford. Scion of the well-British banking dynasty. Yeah, not surprised. Banking cartels, in my opinion. People want to get controls over to us, the sheeps, and the pigeons' lives all the time. Fuck that. I ain't like nobody. Freaking take over my life. Fuck that shit. 
When Bank rose to fame in 1815, was size my boss and my freaking people that are CEO that run the hotel casino. I gotta run. Pfft, still kind of a slave like that, unfortunately, but of course I gotta pay bills. Sad as that is. No, well, yeah, tax wise, I'm still a slave to the system of the Federal Reserves and the freaking Project CERN and fucking pfft, all these other fucking places, all the letter boys of FBI, ICA, NSADA, Washington, D.C., Jewish, and Catholicism and all that, bro. It's a fucking goddamn jungle, bro. It's screwed. Whatever happens, it happens. Or especially the freaking... What was it called? You don't mess with the people that do taxes. Not even NSA anymore. You ain't got to worry about them anymore. It's the other ones you got to worry about even more. IRS is what you got to worry about, Lord. Man. Just four years ago, I heard they were starting to like, train them to use firearms and scary weapon shit. That's what I heard. I don't know if it's true or not. So, da 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 Rothschild made a fortune buying British government bonds in anticipation of Napoleon's defeat at Waterloo. Jacob Rothschild ultimately left his family business to Seattle with Shaji with his cousin Evelyn, selling the state, forming RIT Capital Partners. He chaired the listing investments from 1988 until 2019. Mr. Rothschild also founded J. Rothschild Assurance Group, which is well-known wealth manager of St. James Place alongside Mark Weinberg or Weinberg. Wilson, next one. I swear I'm not sick. I'm just snorting because I got real bad allergies. Motherfucker. Now let's move on. Hopefully I'm not boring, guys. Where it said, quote, is a great sadness we more to pass on our phone and our chairman, Mr. Rothschild. Hannah remains on the board of RIT. The city veteran held many other notable roles in his decade-long career. Between 2003 and 2008, Rothschild was deputy chair of B Sky B Television. That's probably BBC News. I don't know. And he was on the International Advisory Board in the U.S. private equity giant Blackstone. Yeah, it's like BlackRock and Vanguard. Gotta be careful of those dudes. My personal opinion, a lot of these people are just IRA villains. Just freaking hypnotizing, using MKUltra mind control shit. To just do the freaking, have the slaves do their bidding. That's why every time the George Soros of the world and the freaking Gates and the Epsteins of the world tell people to do what they gotta do, they gotta jump, they gotta see how high, which is sad. Will never be a free country. It's just this whole country is a fucking experiment. So the voting election selection shit, in my opinion, that's fucking fraud. Pick your poison and scream me say one fucking crap. But the freaking wings of the eagles, two freaking wings of the same thing. Garson, Democrat, Republican, that's why I'm never getting that whole electing thing because we don't got that fucking power. We don't have no voice. That's a fucking lie. From straight up Federal Reserve banking cartel fucks. In my opinion. I could be wrong. And the Zionists, you know who. I can't even say that either. Let's move on. Banks are Martin Sorswell Investment or S4 Capital after Sorswell departure from advisory group WPP. Outside his corporation life, Mr. Rothschild was not a philanthropist and a patron of the arts, leading several other cultural institutions and personal finance, architectural restorations, and projects in the UK. He served as a chair as a trustee of National Gallery between 1895 and 1991. He shared the Heritage Lottery Fund in 1994 and 1998. Yeah, of course he did. Really knowledgeable and refined. Mr. Lord Rothschild. Ability. Let me just say British House. Ability. To make things happen. Didn't just bring people into Jutsi Gabriella of Finale. And Dr. Gallery. The director. Transformation in late 1990s and the early 1990s. Large measures. Due to his energy and visions, of course. That was a London. No classical sameness here since it's been 16 million quid new pounds on the innovation Spanish has in the 18th century Max Arms and actually green power. Okay, I'm tired of doing that shit. Let's move on to my regular ones. Another personal project on the reinvigoration of Watterson, Maine, non Renaissance Chateau building built in the 1880s by Ferdinand Rothschild and Buckingshire, which he lived next to the door of Jefferson. Oh my god, how long is this? Alright, there it is. Mr. Jefferson, da 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 da. And the house, Jim Coons. Alright. Yeah, that's what it was. Da da da. He filled in artworks of contemporary artists. Jeff Coons, a national trust. Yada yada. There's a house. Sad to hear about Jacob Ross, how he named most of the privilege he was born into. Contributed hugely in cultural, commercial life of Britain, England. George Osborne, former UK, British Chancellor and Chairman in the museum. His contributions to Watterson Gallery and Jewels. Of the British Museum, smart, curious, well, the new projects and new dry humor. I'm going to skip a little bit of this going on to the end here, as well as contributing 
cultural life of Britain, Ross Howe was actively in that word, I can't say. Serving of Yavhan Hadavi or Hadivi. Family Foundation, form 1989 until 2018. Post on X, Twitter, Ross Howe Foundation says, quote, deeply saddened in the mountains of the passing away of well, Ross Charles, businessman, entrepreneur, philanthropist, cultural leader, will be greatly missed by his family, colleagues, and my friends at Adam. Thoughts, views, and things, speculations, it doesn't matter. I'm glad the dude's gone, because just like Mr. Rockefeller was, Ross Charles just as evil as that fool. He must have so many people in there in London, England, and BBC, and freaking Piers Moore, and all these fools in the pockets of so many fools. He had so many in his hands and so many freaking pies. He's probably not in the same place. That dude's probably <laughs> riding a fucking course where he should be, bro. I don't care. I don't care if YouTube takes us down. This <laughs> shit's fucked up that he did. Hurt so many freaking people, man. Sad. In my opinion. And then more British UK news. As I said, I'm gonna do this as a two parter. Kate Middleton photo of Queen Elizabeth. Crank is digitally enhanced. It's from page six, so it's gotta be a legit source. From Miss Bacardi, Francesca Bacardi. Never heard of her. An image of Kate Middleton took Queen Elizabeth and grandchildren and great grandchildren dignity alter according to photo agencies. Examine with the following of Princess of Oil, Mother Day, Snouth. Miss Katie Middleton or Catherine Middleton, I don't know how you say fucking in one of those two word letters. Shadow portrait of April 22nd, my Buckingham Palace did not share it until April 21st, last year, 2023. Which would have been there in the late monarch's 97th birthday. Photos show Queen Elizabeth sitting on the couch in Belmore Castle or Balamore Castle. I don't know how you say this fucking fancy British again. I'm a white wannabe white. Wannabe white. I'm Spanish Latino, Puerto Rican, but I'm an American US citizen. I don't fucking understand these goddamn freaking British UK. I don't know how you say no offense to the normal, average Joe, average men and women out there are England British. Some of your shit is freaking complex. And you still use quid and use different things. Now your commentary on certain things sounds funky. No offense. Some of you British women are super beautiful as hell. You guys, girls are super pretty as so I don't care about the stereotype of your teeth. I messed up. You're still pretty as fuck for girls. And you still look good too. You, know, you got some really, really cool ass history on freaking W dash W dash 2. And you got some badass bomb history on really, really cool stuff. Like, you got your own special, like, birds. You got your own special, like, Foods, even though most of it's from France and Portugal, and I think, correct me if I'm wrong, Italy, it's still badass. And, not to mention, oh man, you got some of the freaking coolest, fanciest cars ever. I will say that about you guys. But it sucks because it rains there all the time, which is depressing. What I heard. And some of your women out there, models. Only, you guys made only fans. You created from there from the UK. It's crazy. Photos show from Queen Elizabeth sitting on that eye. Read that. Noticeably with Prince Harry. The two children, Princess and Prince Lebia, Lobia. Photo agency had declared Queen Elizabeth surrounding her grandkids, a great grandkids coming to the palace, yada yada. It's all this. Black spot and Princess George's cousin dress should be appeared further on the monarchs as cousin the palace. There's also appearing on lines where the cows should be split together. A new added notes from Getty Images. Excuse me. That images were worn and digitally enhanced and restored. At its source. A new editor says, yada yada, yeah, Getty flagged the images as to revisiting photo issues by the Royal UK Family New Year's United Kingdom Mother's Day portrait. See, they quote, taking out notice. I can't say that word. Thoughts, views, opinions, speculation. I don't know if it's real or fake. Anything because deep fake AI shit, that's going to take over everything. That's probably going to make a lot of people lose a fuck ton, shitload of their freaking jobs. And that's not going to be a good thing. I feel bad for them too. No need to sit me starting this behavior, that lady. So when the sweet old innocent British lady, I didn't give a frick, bro. Just like Mr. Rothschild and Gates and all these other fools and Schwab, Epstein and all these other mother offers that are connected with those satanic cabals and the celebrity gossip Hollywood fools. Just suck. I like some of the Hollywood actors. Like I still like Keanu Reeves. I still like Tom Hanks. Shit, with sags. They're part of that super extra scary. In my first opinion, AC the man downstairs, the son of perdition. You're connected to the bathroom and shit. Man, but that's all I have for now. I'm out here. Take it easy. Peace out. Goodbye. Stay tuned for more part two in this video because I'll be talking about this James dude. That's sad. He passed away like that. And that one's a little bit sad. Some people are saying speculation, conspiracy shit. Who knows? I'll see you guys in part two. Link in the description box below, and I'll see you next time. Later.